Here's a Nokia G21. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos directly from your Nokia G21 to your Windows computer, PC, or laptop, okay, as long as it has a Windows OS, a Windows operating system, and we're going to be using the charging cable. So the first thing is go ahead and grab your charging cable that came with your Nokia 21, a USB-A to a USB-C. So the USB-A, I'm going to plug that into my USB port, into my laptop. Next, I'm going to grab my Nokia G21 here. I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Okay, now go ahead and make sure that you go ahead and sign in. All right. Now, you may get a, sign, uh, a little message down here that says allow this phone to connect with the computer. Click on allow if you get the message. Okay, I didn't get one here. But what I also have to do from here is you have to slide down notifications. And then if you look on the bottom right here, it says Android system charging this device via USB. You need to tap on this right here. And then it says tap for more options. We're going to tap one more time. And now you can see by default, they chose no data transfer. What you want is file transfer. Okay, so we're going to tap on file transfer right there. Okay, and something popped up, Nokia G21. Now, from here, we're going to leave our phone like this, and we're going to go ahead and open up the File Explorer, that little yellow folder down there. So we're going to go ahead and open that up. And then from here, on the left pane here, the left pane, the left side here, now if you see My PC here, I'm going to click on My PC. Okay, now right there, you can see my Nokia G21. So let me go ahead and double-click on that. And then Internal Shared Storage, double-tap on that. And now we want to go to the DCIM folder right here, DCIM. Okay, so double click on that. And then under the camera folder here, now this is where I've only taken a few photos and videos with this, uh, with this phone here, but you can see right here. Okay, now you know that they're JPEGs of photos. If it has a JPG file there, you know if it's a movie, it has like a vid in the front. Okay, so from here, very simple. We can go ahead and uh, copy this right to your hard drive. You can even drag and drop, let's, let's say you want this photo on your desktop, you can drag and drop it onto your desktop just like that and let it go. And there it is. Now, what I typically do is I'll right click on the desktop, I'll go to new, I'll go to folder, and I'll just call this one Nokia. And then what I'll do is I'll highlight all my photos and videos, and then I'll drag and drop into that new folder I call Nokia, right there, let it go. Go ahead and let it transfer. And I think it's done transferring. Let me double click on Nokia. Okay, yeah, so all those photos and videos are right there. So now even if I go ahead and unplug my phone here, and I got that Nokia folder right there, I can double tap, and there's my photos and videos on my computer now. Okay, pretty simple. Good luck, guys.